bit of a wasted tackle there, but it gives Southport the chance to reset their line. They come back out to this right-hand side that turn it back inside to Nathan Young. Come back. No, they go the dummy and bury underneath. I think they've got an open for, over for the opening try here. Southport showed the dummy to the right-hand side. Just burrowed in underneath and Chugan caught napping there right under their goalpost. They're just bumping off a few players. Dayberg Mill, oh, it's just opened happen. up in front. Well, he didn't have to do anything. That just caught the ball and just had to run straight. There was absolutely no one in front of Dayberg Mill there and that is as easy a try as you'll get. Tee again taking them on. Now they've slipped it out at half here. It's going to be six more. He goes for Lau. He puts it on the toe with six oh, more tackles in the bank. Free. But has he been managed to pick it up? I think they have gotten away with this, and that is extremely lucky for Southport. Scotty, did you hear the ad? I mean, I said that's dumb footy, and look what's happened. There's a, <laughs> oh, there's brilliant footy. There's a four pointer. <laughs> oh, they were never in doubt. Gee, what an easy victory. Well, last night, 24 16 against the unbeaten Burley. Well, gee whiz. You know. Oh, here we go. Dayberg Muir is taking a beautiful inside ball. Look at the footwork here from Dayberg Muir. Still going. Can he connect up? Oh, he's done it beautifully. Potting her on the inside there. What a fantastic try there. And it all came back to a Wakati here again, linking up with in the half again sends it out Rio puts it on the toe nice and early in the uh, tackle count they this. get the bounce back this. now they've got plenty of numbers on the inside and Turner oh in support well again Rio just put it on the toe didn't really get too much purchase off it and the bounce of the football everything is going Southport's way at the moment but they had four other options yeah. for the Tigers they go down that right hand side Again, turn it back on the inside. Rio sends it out again, and they have scored it straight away in the second half. Well, everything that they would have spoken about at the halftime break there, the coaching staff, just get into the game at the second half. We've got to beat it. away. Grant puts it on the toe. It's bouncing around, and Grant, like a pinball, manages to pick up the crumbs, and... It, Chugan have finally got their first try of the match. Put it on the toe here. Oh, oh good try. Josh That's Harvey good try. in support. Wow, beautiful work there. Will Johnson summed it up beautifully coming out of half. There was no one at the back there. It's a two. Can he stretch oh, out? No, geez, he holds on to it. He thought about it, didn't he? Oh, there's players just, offside. Outside. Colton, <laughs> he's just going to steamroll over. So they get there in the end at the Southport side, but they were in sixes and sevens, Chugan. They couldn't. Thereabouts, yeah, it is. So there's a positive at least that they can take. Flout. Look at him go. Oh, it gets a nice ball on the inside as well. Game. They take the fullback on. He skips on the outside with Teen. He's going to go himself. And a plants it down. Potting up, they send it right, they've got numbers galore, off the toe of Rio, and bounces up perfectly, Corey Walker, Johnny on the spot, and oh, it was four on two out there, and acres of space, and Mescal, little one off the toe, bounces, oh, again, there's space in front of the Tigers here, Hampson still going. Still going is Hampson. Throws it back on the inside. Now it's play on. They might, they're going to get it here. Stop Atar it. is streaking away. And he's got to plant it under the post as well. Oh, <laughs> that was a little bit of a clunky put down in the end. But what about Atar? Just put the foot down.